Lynn here, and welcome to another video. In this particular video, we are going to be making snow slime, which you'll see here in this bowl behind me, haha. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I figured just because Christmas is over does not mean that winter is. It's still wintry and cold out and snowing in certain parts of the US and all over the world. So what I decided to do is make snow slime. We saw this craft online, and I thought that I wanted to try it. So Mom's gonna pick some up. I might touch it for you guys and later in the video, but Mom's gonna pick some up to show you what it's like. So this is what we're gonna be making in today's video. It is called Snow Slime. <laughs> All right guys, so behind me here, you will see the supplies that you are going to need to make this snow slime, haha. <laughs> so yeah, and like I mentioned before, just because Christmas is over, does not mean that winter is. So that's why we decided to wait and do this project now. So let's go over the things you're gonna need. You are going to need two separate bowls, a liquid measuring cup. You will also need measuring spoons and a spoon to stir with. You will also need pixie glitter. This is very fine cut, small pieces of glitter. It's loose glitter and you can use any color you want. You could use silver, a blue, or an opalescent, which is what we're gonna be using. You will also need a few bottles of white school glue. Any brand will do. And lastly, you will need a small, very small amount of borax. And the only other thing you're gonna need that was not pictured here is water. So let's get started. Welcome to our snow slime tutorial. As Lammy just mentioned, you will be needing certain supplies and ingredients. So I'm gonna explain how all of these supplies and ingredients go with one another. The first bowl you will need is going to be for the water, which I will get into in just a minute, the glue, and the glitter. The second bowl is for a separate amount of water and some of the borax. In the first bowl, you'll be adding the glue. What we have here is just regular, white, non-toxic school glue. Um, this is just a generic brand of Elmer's school glue. These bottles that we have here are five fluid ounces each, and we're going to be dumping both of those bottles into our bowl. So then the recipe says that we are to add three-fourths of a cup of very warm water. So we just turned our hot water on from the kitchen sink and we just filled it up to three-fourths of a cup and we're supposed to add that to the glue. So it looks like that. Then it says to add the glitter. You can add as much or as little glitter as you like. So we're just going to sprinkle that pixie glitter in and you can see how it's on the top there. And now we're gonna stir it up. So stir it up very well. And let's get on to mixing the ingredients in our second bowl. In the second bowl, we are going to add some borax. It says to add um, a heaping spoonful of 1 4th teaspoon. So I am going to get a heaping teaspoon of this. Heaping means that it's kind of rounded at the top and it's not flattened out. So I'm gonna add that in the bowl right like that. And to the borax, it says to add 2 thirds of a cup of very warm water. All right, so I'm going to stir that up really quick and I'm just gonna use the uh, teaspoon that I had. So I'm gonna stir up that borax in that water until it dissolves. All right, so both of the ingredients in both bowls are completely mixed up together now. And now it says that what I'm supposed to do is combine both bowls. So I'm gonna pour this into here and stir it all up. Hey mom. Yeah? Before you do that, could you please add some of the blue glitter? The blue glitter or the silver? The blue? Yeah, the blue. I think it'd be pretty. It would remind me of Frozen. Okay, all right. Okay, let me get the vial. Okay, so Lammy wants to add some of the blue glitter over here. You can see it sprinkled there on the top. So there we go. So I'm gonna mix that up. Well, you can kind of see it in there, can't you? Yeah, I just think it add a nice shimmer. Okay, well, yeah, it's in there. I can see it. I'll, we'll have to zoom in so the kids can see it, but it's there. All right, so now we're going to add that water and borax mixture into here. All right, all right, so I'm going to stir this up. 
a little bit. So now we have to get our spoon out of there because as you can see, it's already starting to gel. All right, so the next part some of you will think is gross and some of you will like. So I guess it just depends on your personality and what kinds of things you're into. So basically what we have to do now is we have to play with this with our fingers. It says you have to knead it with your fingers and the snow slime will start to form. Okay, so it's been a few minutes and we're still kneading it. And as you can see, it's starting to get thicker. Okay, so now we have snow slime. So see, it's just this slimy, gooey stuff. I think they sell some type of slime stuff like this in uh, the store, but it's just a gooey, slimy kind of thing. It's, it's, it's um, thinner than Play-Doh, but it would remind you of Play-Doh. So see, there it is, guys. So we now have snow slime. Lammy, do you wanna come touch it? I don't know, Mom, it looks pretty gross. Oh, come here and touch it. You wanted to make this recipe. Come here. Come here. Oh, all right. Wow, yeah, that's pretty gross. It smells like glue. Well, that's because there's glue in it. There's another thing in the recipe. We didn't have any of it, but there's a thing. It said that you could add peppermint oil or something like that, and it would make it smell like peppermint, and it would be like refreshing and everything. Oh, we didn't have that, so ours smells like glue. But that's okay, Mom, it's all right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna touch it. You're gonna touch it, are you sure? Yeah, I think I'm gonna touch it. I'm gonna touch it, ew, it's slimy, it's kinda cool. Put some on my paw, Mom. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, gross, it's cool though, guys. Check out my snow slime, ha 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 ha. Oh yeah, that's pretty disgusting. But I like it, ha ha ha. Now that it's done and settled, what you could do is you could put this in a Tupperware container or in a Ziploc bag or something like that to store it. Um, make sure not to get this on carpet or clothing or anything like that because I do think that it would stick a little bit. I just think it's interesting how the borax and the water and the glue mixes together and makes it do this. Borax is some amazing stuff, guys. See, guys, and the longer you leave it, the gooier it gets. Check it out, guys. Huh, it looks like a huge marshmallow. Ew, bleh. <laughs> That's so neat, Mom. Look, guys, it's a big blob. It's the blob. Gross. <laughs> so tell me, have you guys ever made anything like this before? If you have, let me know in a comment below. Also, let me know what other craft videos you guys might like to see this year. Yeah, we like doing craft videos. But yeah, let us know if there's anything in particular or craft that you guys like or know about that you'd like to see us try out. Bloop. Ha ha ha, so cool. Anyway, guys, uh, we'll talk to you next time. Be sure to subscribe. I have a lot of videos coming for 2015. Um, follow me on my uh, social media, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Those links are in the description box below. And I'll talk to you next time, guys. Bye. Blah, 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 blah,